She said yes! <laughs> What's up? My name's Courtney. Welcome back to my channel. Today's a really exciting video because we are engaged and I'm going to tell you all about how it happened. It would mean so much if you would subscribe to my channel and put the notifications bell on as well as like this video because I'm coming out with a lot of new videos and they'll definitely be a wedding series. So I guess this is technically a wedding series episode one and I have a lot of fun stuff that I have planned to do. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get started. backstory. Nick and I have been together for over 11 years. We were 13 and 15, so really young, and we both are ballet dancers, so we met that way, and we started partnering together and taking classes and learning how to dance partnering, basically learning how the fundamentals of partnering is together, which was now looking back really special that we had that time. So we got to dance together a lot, and then after three years, Nick got accepted to a college in Germany, so he went to the state ballet school over there. While Nick was in Germany, I was in California for one more year finishing my training and then I got my first job in a professional ballet company with Festival Ballet Providence in Rhode Island. So then we were long distance from Germany to Rhode Island which actually was a harder time difference because six hours it was mostly six hours between Germany time and East Coast time. So when I was getting off work he was already going to sleep. When I was waking up he was asleep or vice versa. So that was really difficult. We did a lot of Skyping but uh, we made it through and then we finally got our job together in Santa Barbara with ballet company State Street Ballet with this company we had the opportunity to dance together for five years and we had a lot of really fun moments and a lot of fun performances that we got to do. Now we're both finishing our degrees and master's and bachelor's degrees and while that is going on also the pandemic so we've been just home. While not dancing we have both found a love for being on the mountain and I really enjoy skiing, he enjoys snowboarding. I didn't know how good he was at snowboarding until after the fact because while dancing we both couldn't really do activities that could chance injury because then your career is on the line. So so now um, we're able to have more fun and do those types of things and experiment with different activities. This year for New Year's, uh, we talked about wanting to go up to the mountain and have a group of friends together and go in on an Airbnb. So we got a small group together and got the Airbnb and all tested negative before the trip. For COVID. The first day it was just a small group of us and it was on the 30th. The first day was just really getting into the swing of things and our whole group wasn't up there yet so it was just a small group of us and we were having a lot of fun just being up on the mountain.
then on New Year's Eve, we had our full group together and it was really fun because we had never done anything with such a big group before for New Year's. We're usually just home with our families, maybe playing some card games and board games. And it was really cool because my sister was there and her boyfriend and also my mom and then all of our really close friends. Nick said it'd be cool if we took a group photo up on the top of the mountain and I thought that was a really cool idea. We all got on the lift and went up to the mountain and took a group photo. After that, Nick said he wanted to do a dance lift photo, which really wasn't out of the norm for us because we take dance photos everywhere. Um, I'll put a few clips here of some of the different dance photos that we've taken throughout the 11 years. And then after that, he got down on one knee and asked me to marry him. Hey. So pretty. Nicholas, look at the camera. Yes. I think it's pretty obvious that I was in complete shock <laughs> and it was definitely a really special experience. I'm really grateful that a lot of our close friends and family were there to see the special time of our lives. She said yes! <laughs> Woo! Thanks here! Amazing day, amazing day. And then we got some really cute photos afterwards and I'll put some of those here too. Obviously, it's still New Year's Eve, so we got to have a little small gathering in our Airbnb that night and kind of just celebrate our engagement and both the new year. So this is the ring, and it is so pretty. Nick did such a good job. It's still hard to believe that I'm wearing it. So I definitely want to do like a bridesmaid proposal box video, wedding dress shopping, and all those really fun wedding series. So if you want to stick around for those, it would mean so much if you would hit that subscribe button. Thanks so much for hanging out with me and being a part of today's video. I hope to see you in another video real soon. Thanks. Bye. All the stuff that... <laughs> what? Because I'm going to be... <laughs> I hope to see you in another video. <laughs> today's a really exciting video. Today's a really exciting event. Why is this one so hard to film?